Hey everybody, welcome back to Off the Trail. The other day I was out at the cabin and a buddy of mine uh, called me up and said he needed some help doing some recovery work um, in a local lake. And I had a lot of gear, but I didn't quite have enough weight on me. Um, while I didn't have any uh, enough weight, I did have a pair of jeans and some lead shot back in the uh, back cabinet. So you know what that means. Let's get started. Now people might ask how reliable this process is, but um, actually I've been making weights like this for over 20 years. So um, it actually is very reliable and they last a long time. But anyhow, so this is what you start with. This is a standard four pound weight, um, lead shot weight. I start with a pair of blue jeans and I'm gonna cut a pocket, sew it up and make it about the same size as that four pound weight and uh, just leave a little opening in the top. I think you guys know where this is gonna go from here. We're gonna take our lead shot. We're gonna go ahead and fill up the little uh, denim bag and uh, move on from there. Now there's a couple different ways you can approach this. Um, obviously you could just uh, get yourself a little funneling device, a piece of paper, uh, tube it up, whatever, stick it down in there or just pour the shot directly into the bag. It works fine and I've got a, a lot of old weights that I've never had any problem with like that. The thing is, is um, this still has to be sewn up. So the easiest thing to do, especially if you've already got your weight in a, paper, a plastic bag like this, is just go ahead, roll it right up, and stuff the entire plastic bag right inside. The little denim pouch. What that's going to help you with is when you go to sew this up, now I can lay this if I've got a sewing machine, if I'm not going to do this by hand and try to like lock stitch it or something like that. Um, if I've got a sewing machine now, I can lay this right on the sewing machine. I've got no worries about the lead, uh, lead shot coming out of the pocket there. And uh, once it's all sewn up, we'll go from there. Okay, so here we have our finished pouch all sewn up. Um, you can see how it compares to the uh, stitching on the other one that I did several years ago. Um, maybe not as beautiful, but I was kind of in a hurry for this video. Anyhow, Grandma used to say that uh, a man who can't cook or a man who can't sew is just about useless. And uh, you know what, I'd have to agree with her on that. It's funny how many guys uh, can tear down a machine or tear down some other type of tool, but they uh, act like children when it comes to a sewing machine or something like that. It really doesn't make any sense. So anyhow, there you have it. This is our finished pouch for now. And uh, we're going to go ahead and put it on the scale and see what it weighs out at and uh, move forward. Stay tuned. Okay, everybody, we're back. We got the scale out. Hopefully, uh, in this light, you'll be able to read the uh, digital display there. And we'll go ahead and uh, put that weight on there. And let's see what it weighs out at. Looks like the scale is going to read 3 pounds, 7.8 ounces. So I feel uh, pretty comfortable calling that a 3.5 pound weight. Um, I didn't measure out that shot before we started, so uh, I'm cool with that. I like uh, denominations of four, um, three to four pounds anyhow. So uh, I think 3.5 is what I'm gonna go ahead and write on this one. Just go ahead and take the old Sharpie marker and uh, get that taken care of. All right, well, there she is, uh, 3.5. I usually write it on both sides like that. Um, you know, not really bad considering uh, how much weight costs these days. Um, it's going to fit in the same pockets that either one of those uh, professional weights are going to fit into. Um, not bad for some material that's been laying around uh, in the back of the cabin for a while uh, that I don't need anymore. And uh, I did need it as a weight, however, so it uh, served its purpose. That's all we got for today. Thanks for joining us once again for Off the Trail. Um, I appreciate your support. Check out our uh, other videos, our contest. We're always trying to give stuff away here. Got too much stuff laying around, I guess. Um, so check those out. Check out our other videos. Uh, we appreciate your comments. And we'll see you on the next one.